Hey guys, it's me Kakar, and um, th this is just a video why, uh, why I personally don't like Dream and his fan base. I am only going to be, I'm mostly going to be talking about his fan base and him. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna talk about um. Uh, Tubbo, uh, what else? George and Tommy in it. There was a thing uh, where he did it in one of his streams, uh, him doing a war cry before going into a Minecraft PvP. People start to get uh, offended and saying it's making fun of Native American war cries. But I personally think that's... <sighs> come on. Like, come on. <sighs> But Dream, as he does, apologized for that and said it. They were trying to sound like the scene from SpongeBob where they all say, <laughs> In that same moment, they all uh, they all said La Resistance. Hmm. I, I wonder if they're gonna uh, if he's gonna apologize for that too. There was another moment where he cheated in a Minecraft speedrun and uh, lied about it. A year later, he finally apologizes. You heard me right. A year. He even hired a quote-unquote expert to say it's legit. D to be honest, it makes no sense trying to cover up that. Just a uh, just. Just to later say you cheated that same uh, that same as if I hacked club penguin so I can say the beep -be word That's the only moments I'll talk about when he apologized for stuff. Oh Can we also talk about how unfunny he is? like uh, this one tweet which slides into this chapter right, uh, right here Dream tweets about Dream Smile merch is a waste of money. Is this you? To be honest, as a as a Adidas, oh, is it where I personally wear, I personally wear it for style, and also it feels comfortable. You know, let's you know. This comes kind of so slack. I haven't seen the merch yet, so uh, let's let's see his merch. See if it's any better. It's just a smiley face. You could have done better, really. Dude, I I could I could make that with uh, with a sharpie marker. And one of my old ass shirts, and it would still be way better. And also, here's another one with just the word dream on it. Wow, how creative! So, Mr. Extreme, how do you feel about the dream merch? Green. Yeah, and also, how the fuck did we even get in here? Like, what is this? $40? Jesus Christ. Well, I guess it has, like, a $15, $20 advantage against Adidas. I mean, like, look at this. $60 and $55? Wow. 
Well, at, at least at least they'll keep, they keep you warm. And no, I'm not gonna test out the fucking dream merch. Uh, I'm not spending forty dollars on that, dude. Look, look, I'm not spending forty dollars on that. Well, mostly because I don't have that. I almost forgot to mention that Nike is, is a little bit uh, oh is it cheaper than uh, Adidas, so uh, so it'll be more affordable. So yeah. The fan base, it's cringe. But l let me tell you about the first part of the fan base. It it's mostly filled with kids. You you're probably thinking, Cat God, it's a Minecraft YouTuber. <laughs> of course it's towards kids. Okay, okay. I, I get it. But it's the way the uh, it's the uh, it's the way the kids act. In the fan base, the uh, the fan base does cosplaying as Dream or Technoblade or etc. Uh, in public, okay. To be honest, I did cosplay when I was in a fan base. I cosplayed as Mario when I was eight on Halloween. The sad thing is, I was subscribed to Dream, and I was uh, around the same age as the cringe, de uh, cringe demographic, and I didn't do this t uh, this kind of stuff. I uh, f I feel like I'm far away from my generation. Oh, and also, uh, there's the TikToks that I won't be showing uh, because this video is becoming a little long. But here's a screenshot. Glad you made it this far. No, nobody has ever survived that much cringe. For your reward, here is a video of Sasha. Sassy! Gaggy! Here we have the dream sexuals. Oh boy, where do I begin? They aren't part of the LGBTQ community. They're a joke to the LGBTQ community. They don't listen to common sense. They are too young to even be a part of it. They are obsessed with a, a guy that's a little over 22, and they don't even know what he looks like. And they're gonna think that Dream is gonna date them and commit pedophilia. Come on! Seriously. Where do I begin? Okay, first of all, let's start with the animation, since I don't want to listen to the music yet. <sighs> the animation. It, it looks like a parody of Pixar. And that's a compliment, really. More than an insult. An insult would look like... I, I can't really think of a insult that that turns out to be a a compliment. Like no ser no seriously, it's that it's it's that bad. The eyes, the the mask. It, what? Oh, let's go to the music. With a smile for hours at a time, stare at it. I hold back. I'm too nice. Okay, he could have rhymed. He, he could have rhymed. 
while while music pl uh, played, at least that would have been better. But 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 no 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 no. It, it, it just sounds weird. It sounds bad. The animation. I already talked about that. I don't want to talk about it again, but seriously. It, it could have been 2D. It could have had like 2D animators. That, that would have been way better. But no, no. The music, it's it's just bad. And when other people sing it, it just, it just makes you cringe. Ugh. It, ugh. I don't want to talk about it anymore. Plus, he commented uh, on a tweet that someone was criticizing his music. And he said, uh, well, he didn't want it to be about drug stuff. And he uh, tweeted... Uh, Drugs, drugs, A.O. Charles, uh, turn that up. And after that, he apologized. <laughs> uh. His manhunts are okay, kind of good. But sometimes I feel like it's kind of staged. And also, his merch could, it could do a little bit more effort. His tweets are... <sighs> It tweet to our fuel for cringe, um, and the fan base. <sighs> Guess what word I'm about to say? Yeah, cringe. Um, yeah, I feel like he could do just a te uh, just a teeny bit m more effort and stuff. He did say that uh, oh, he does not, oh, he does not like how people are. Uh, are acting in his fan base, so that that you gotta give him respect for that. And I like his cat. His cat's his cat. His cat's cool. And um, what else? There, uh, I guess he's good at Minecraft. Yeah, but yeah, what else there is to say?